Hey you guys, what's up? It's Steez. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, yes, yeah, so this will be my second video in like 12 to 14 hours. So, you know, maybe I was being too hard on myself about the whole like not feeling inspired thing because it's funny, it's like if, I'm not, if I don't feel inspired for like 4 or 5 days, it's just like my creative juices start flowing again and I'm just like so invested and like so here for you guys. So, in today's video, um, I just figured that I would play with makeup a little bit, um, <clears throat> possibly talk about like some YouTuber conspiracy theories. But also, um, I think what I'm going to do is kind of like, um, a full face of, uh, pink and blue. So that's what I'm going for. So I'm, I'm thinking that because I did blue lipstick, um, in like three videos in the past week, um, that I'm definitely going to do uh, some pink lipstick, and I might double layer, layer it or whatever, but I'm going to use this um, LAC Metal um, Lipstick. The shade name is Rose Dust, um, and then I'm probably going to, since this one isn't the metal one, which I, I believe is that uh, the metal um, entails, or like it's kind of like a disclaimer that it's like a metallic, this one, on the other hand, um, is just like, I think, a, a regular matte finish or whatever, but it's um, the shade name is Tantalize. Which I love that. So I'm going to mix those two, play with it, possibly top it with a little bit of this um, LA Colors Glossy Lips um, Moisturizing Sheer Lip Gloss uh, in shade Popsicle Dream. Yes. Um, going to do all that fun stuff. Um, like, as you can see, my um, my pimple from today, from uh, earlier today's video, or this morning's video, um, has gotten a lot better. So I'm definitely not going to do um, concealer um, and foundation, just because I'm going to let my skin rest. But, um... Like, I know that I was, like, I jinxed myself and stuff in the last video, but my skin's looking pretty good. Like, I'm going to be 28 this year. I know that's not old, but at the same time, like, at the same time, like, I indoor tanned a shit ton, and, um, basically I'm just, like, thank you, universe. Like, a round of applause, you know? <laughs> I love you, universe. Thank you. I appreciate it. Steez is here for all that good stuff. So, yeah, I figured I'd wear my little, um, Bob Ross with a uh, t-shirt, good vibes only, that's wrinkled as a bitch. But, um, <clears throat> okay, since we're not going to do foundation and concealer, that's, um, out of the way already. So we might as well move on to lips. I love doing lips. Okay. Let's see how rose dust. Oh, no, wait, I said I was going to do that one second. Because it's, yeah, no, this one's the one I'm doing first. The, uh, yeah, the shade is a rose dust. And it's by LAC. And I like how the LAC is, um, iridescent-esque, iridescent-y. <laughs> But, um, yeah, let me break out my e.l.f. Cosmetics Light Cream Blush Palette Compact, because it's got a large mirror. Okay. Mmm. I believe this lipstick was $1.50, maybe $2. And look at that. It's like lipstick with highlighter in it. Can I mean... Can you ask for more, or can you ask for much more for a dollar fifty or two dollars? No, you can't. How are you guys doing today? I got zero comments on my last video. You know what I mean, and that's fine. Like I don't, I'm not like here, like I'm like like have a Steve's pity party. Like please comment on all my videos. Like that's not the case at all. Um, it's just weird because like my last like seventeen video, well ten to eleven videos maybe. Um, maybe seventeen was a little bit of an, of an exaggeration, but no. Um. I was just getting like daily comments and you know stuff and stuff like that. I mean, I'm still getting the views. Don't get me wrong, and that's not what it's about. But I mean, my interactions with you guys and your constructive criticism is everything, and the whole reason that I'm I'm a YouTuber in the first place. It really is. This stuff blends like a dream, and um, I, I've only worn it one time on my channel. Are you kidding me? Let's turn off that big light so you can really see like the highlighting. Um. Like glittery tones in it. And for once in my life, your girl Steez is not gonna overdraw those lips. I wish you guys could feel 
Oh yeah, I was about to say, I thought this one, uh, this one had a fragrance. It does not, but um, I wish you guys could smell through the um, camera monitor because it smells so freaking good. Okay. Let's see, do I want to top it with um, tantalize or whatever it's called? Yeah, tantalize by LAC. Let's just like give it a whirl and see what happens. I don't want to lose too much of that glittery effect, you know what I mean? Because it's everything right now. I'm feeling that pink lip fantasy. I closed my compact. I guess it was an instinctive. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm still. Get I'm getting over a cold. Slash. I don't know what it is. It's been going on for like 48 hours. But um. Like hello. Like not overdrawing your lips at all, steez, and still feeling confident. You go, girl. Okay. <clears throat> Since we're feeling a pink and blue fantasy. Um. Obviously, you know what I mean? Like, for foundation, it's going to be... <coughs> foundation. I already said I wasn't going to do foundation. Ah! Okay. Um, uh, I think for blush, I'm going to use... My, um, e.l.f. Cosmetics Light Cream Blush Palette, like I mentioned earlier. Yes, she's a doll. Love her. See, right? If you look over so closely, it says light, I believe. Focus, you bitch. Okay, never mind. I guess it doesn't matter. But, um, okay. So... Uh, let's get to blushing, girls and boys. So, um, in uh, uh, early, earlier today's video, or to, the video from earlier today that I made, um, the Courtney Love Inspire makeup tutorial, or whatever, and talking about James Charles, Tati Westbrook, and Rich Lux, um, I used this shade of pink right here. So, just because I don't like to, like, you know, repeat stuff too much, um, I'm going to dive into this one right above it. It's a little bit less, it's, uh, I think it's a little bit less hot pink, but at the same time, uh, yeah, it's a little bit less of a hot pink, but that's okay. <clears throat> okay, and um, luckily, the, luckily, that the, the sounded weird, no, um, but for, um, like, it's going to be a full face of blue and pinks, but um, I don't have blue blush, and I don't know if that would look good necessarily, so um, I'm going to do blue eyeshadow, and um, uh, a blue, a, a blue slash silver slash green highlighter, so that that's whenever the, um, the blues will come into play, I promise you that. And I'm going to try to go as lightly as I possibly can on blush today. I went a little bit overboard yesterday. I'll be the first one to tell you whenever my makeup look wasn't necessarily the best. And, um, I mean yesterday. Uh, well, kind of yesterday because I've slept since then. But, um, moral of the story is I went a little bit ham on that blush, y'all. But, um... Yeah, like, I mean, if you're new to my channel, sometimes I, I either do um, a southern accent or I do a British accent whenever I'm doing my, ma my makeup. I don't know why. Um, am I mentally unstable? <laughs> Maybe. Is it documented? Possibly. <laughs> but uh, I don't think that's the reason why. Turn on that big light make sure they match up because you can really tell them. Yeah, I'm being too hard on myself. That's beautiful. I mean, this I've had this blush palette for a good four months, and I mean, it, I stand by it. It's fantastic. As well as um, this e.l.f. Neutralizing Concealing Palette, and as well as I think that e.l.f. Cosmetics Beauty Sponges are so much better than the actual beauty blenders. But that's just my little gay opinion. Ah, <sighs> okay, so, um, got my compact out, um, and to, for the next step, I'm going to dive into my CoverGirl True Naked Days Palette. And I know, like, I drug it pretty hard in my review of it, like, <clears throat> about two weeks ago. But in the video, I said that um, the only colors that I would personally use are the first three and uh, these two right here. Or maybe these, these two right here, I don't remember. But um, I chose this one uh, to just kind of like um, cut my creases on both sides for eyeshadow. And um, because that one's the only non-metallic in there, and I think that's why I like it so much is because it's a lot it's a lot more smooth and buttery. Like, see how I barely touched it? Yeah, that was my favorite one. Um, and the... Do not 
get mad, Steez. Compose yourself. It's just a YouTube video, and it's just your lighting. And you don't have, like, a, a proper doc for it yet? That's okay. Calm down. Deep breaths. <sighs> Okay, you guys, I'm back. I'm a, I'm a human bobblehead now. Am I even human? I don't know. But, um, yes, we're going to dive into my CoverGirl 2 Naked Days palette. Um, I'm going to use one of the only usable shades in the palette. And I'm going to, like I said, cut my crease before my lighting fell down or whatever. I'm going to cut my crease or whatever and go from there. And, um, because there's either one, there's, a, there's either one or two more blue shades in there or a green shade that I can incorporate into it. And make, well, no, I can't use green. It's a purple. I mean, it's a pink and blue talent. Each of those lipsticks was was, adult, was no more than two dollars. I mean, really? I, I can't. It, 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 it shocks me every single time that like when a product that really holds up, like, I, and I actually stand for it. Oh, hey, Steez in the mirror. How are you? I love you. <laughs> <sighs> the life of having no friends. Just kidding. Okay. Yeah, this was this was one of the, the shades. I remember saying in the video, in my review video about this palette, you know, because it was like uh, ten dollars plus tax. But um, I said that this shade is the only non-metallic in the entire palette. Um, was my, I didn't say it was my favorite, but um, I might have, I may have actually said it was my favorite. I don't really remember. Yeah, that's super blendable. Um, okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna top that like uh like and draw um and trace my brow line this brow line right here, um on both sides and then I'm going to even even out um the uh, what I did around my eyes just because I like um doing a little bit of um eyeshadow beneath um the lower lash line if that makes sense I hope that it does God. Hi, it's Steez the Clown. Welcome back to my channel. I'm just kidding. I, I, I love this challenge, and I, and you know, if you're um, familiar with my channel, you know that um, your girl Steez stays true to a challenge. So, okay, we're going to dive into this color next to it right here that's like almost an indigo. But watch the fallout, though. That's the only thing. See it? So much. It's ridiculous. And I'm, I'm not, I'm barely even swatching it, but, like, is that blue? Is that, does that say in the blue realm? I believe so. It has blue. It has blue tones. I mean, you guys can drag me if you want, but if if you do, then I'll title this the blue and purple and pink challenge. Which I mean, I could have I could have just like said like you know blue and green and pur yeah. It doesn't matter. <laughs> Whatever. You're being too hard on yourself, girl. I promise. Okay, let's work some of that product to the tip of that um, little drugstore. Um, uh, I guess you could call it a shadow brush. I'm not really sure what what it's called. Turn this big light on. Okay. Yes. Yes, that's exactly what I wanted to happen. Okay. <sighs> oh, honey. <laughs> honey, 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 honey. <laughs> um, Okay, so, um, yeah, as you can see, um, I touched up my eyes off camera, um, you guys already got to see, uh, the, the shades that I blended, um, it's a lot more Peacock Fantasy than, um, I had, I had anticipated, for example, um, my CoverGirl 470 Demi Matte Peacock, or whatever, um, is very, very similar, I watch whenever I close my eyes, and yes, I did mascara off camera too, but that's all I did, um, I just adjusted this and everything, and, like, kind of zhuzhed it and everything, and made it match up, because they're sisters, not twins. I love how everything I, I have like has like gold and purple with tones in it and everything I have matches so but yeah as you can see watch I'll close my eyes from a few angles yes it's very peacock like and um that was not my intention seeing as I wear the lipstick all the time okay um so we've done shadow and um for highlighter yes um let me see though is there anything from my more 35k palette <sighs> I've used, like, um, these silver shades or whatever, um, as highlighter before, 
as well as this gold one and these two gold ones. Um, I don't necessarily see like um, a blue-esque one, any ones with blue tones, but at the same time... Ooh. But I've used, I, I don't know. What's a girl to do, boys and girls? Ooh. I mean, I, I, have, I have used um, highlighter. I mean, like I, like I just said, like I've used golden and um, silver. Uh, did I mention that my camera got overheated? Because that's what happened. That's that's why I had to take a little hiatus. But yeah, this, it's, it's bizarre. I don't even know why. It's like not even that. I, I, I'll give you a second to, to get where you're going, sir. Are you kidding me? <laughs> okay, thank you. Pedestrian on a motorcycle, whatever you want to call it yourself. Okay, um, yeah. So I mean, like I, I just said, the, I just said, I just, I could actually, genuinely, literally got through saying that I've used these two shades and a, a few of these gold ones and stuff as well as highlighters. So, um, from the shades that I can use and stay true to the challenge of um, the pink and blue, I could look at my CoverGirl True Naked Days palette and um, I could attempt to use this as a highlighter. It's really dark, but I could just not do that much of it. You know what I mean? Like, I don't have to go super crazy just because it's a highlighter. That's what I normally do, but I'm really curious to see what happens with this one. Okay, one, two, three. I'm using the same angled brush from yesterday's video. Um, a fan or slash viewer or whatever you want to call her <laughs> had advised me not to use um, uh, this uh, Wet n Wild um, fan brush for highlighter because that's why, like, I've hit so much pan in my, um, Fenty Beauty Kilowatts Edition shields or whatever, like, so fast, like, less than, in less than two months, or less than a month and a half or whatever. But, uh, let's work that product to the, to the tip. <sighs> okay. I mean, it, it, um, if I'm not, if I'm, if I'm nothing else, I'm very adventurous. You know, you can never take that away from me. I love you guys so much for being here. I'll give it a chance. It is a metallic, so I mean... <laughs> yeah. That is a freaking gorgeous highlighter. Oh my god. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Okay, um, no, that delayed reaction was, like, on purpose, but, um, yeah, so, um, my camera got overheated again. No, no, it didn't. Never mind, that was last time. I'm, 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 like, here lying to you guys. Um, no, my, my mascara has time, has had time to dry, but, um, no, um, as, I tried, um, this shade. <laughs> if you can't laugh at your fucking self, right? Um, oh god, I've been trying not to, I've been trying not to say the F word on camera. I apologize to any of my younger viewers. <laughs> But, um, I, I actually literally genuinely, like, attempted to use this as highlighter. Yeah, so I'm glad I didn't cut that out. But, I mean, um, I had to go adjust or whatever. Um, and if you, if you can't tell, um, I dived into, or I dove into, my Cheek Leaders Mini Bronze Quad Highlighting, Contouring, and Bronzing P Palette by Benefit Cosmetics. Um, and I used the shade Gold Rush for bronzer off camera, as well as I used the shade, um, I used the shade Gold Rush for bronzer, um, on my jawline, uh, on both sides as well as uh, my forehead line. Let me turn on the big light if you can, and you can really kind of see the the bronze of it all. Like, I mean, the reason why I chose to do um, the bronzing um, and contouring and stuff at the jawline um, is because um, I saw JLo's makeup artist um, do Tati Westbrook's um, uh, makeup the same way. So, took a page out of your book, girl. I love you, Tati. Okay, um, like I was saying, Gold Rush right here. Yes, that was for bronzer. Right here, as you can see, just compare the colors. And like, I know, I was thinking like, it looks a lot like my blush, but it doesn't. See how pink the blush is? And like, see the shade of Gold Rush? Yeah, totally matches up on both sides. And look at my forehead in comparison. Yes, for sure. Love it. And um, for contour on my nose, I just did my nose. And that's why it doesn't look crooked. You know, it obviously is crooked. But um, I use the shade Hoola right here, H-O-O-L-A. It's off my benefit, Cheek Leaders Mini Bronze Squad Palette. Love it, it was $30, $45 value. Check it out if you haven't. <clears throat> okay, so I said I wasn't going to use this since it's like um, 
a pink um, and blue challenge or whatever, or full face of pink and blue makeup. Um, I just decided that I was like, I know I said I wasn't going to use it, and um, you know, sometimes people change their designs. And since my my brush is dirty, I don't, my brush that I use, my little angled brush that is really is a lot better for highlighter. I'm just since this, this one is the only highlighter that I have. If you look closely, that stays true to that blue um, and pink challenge. See the blue tones? Yeah, for sure. So I'm using my Fenty Beauty, as you can see on that beautiful, beautiful dirty mirror. You can't even see it. Yeah, Fenty Beauty um, Chills Kilowatts Edition. I don't. I, I never know if you guys can see it correctly or not. I'm still new to this whole YouTube thing, but I'm just gonna be really, really, really delicate um, to my commenters and stuff that have said that I hit pan so much because I use this brush and a little does go a long way but since I'm really feeling that um, pink and blue fantasy um, I'm gonna use a little bit more highlighter today and now that I'm looking at myself like I'm not mad at the fact that I didn't wear <sighs> concealer and foundation I'm actually really glad that I let this part of my skin um, heal because I didn't put any makeup on that part of my skin at all and it's actually looking like a lot better since it, um, earlier today's video or like I'm, I'm my video that was like 13, 14 hours ago by the time I upload it, because it's it turned out turned out to be a little bit more long than I anticipated, which is always a good thing if you guys are here for this kind of thing. I'm living for the peacock look on my eyes, and I'm really impressed with the colors that are usable from this CoverGirl True Naked Day, Days palette, and I feel bad for dragging them in the past. But if you if you're new to my channel, you're not aware of the fact that I don't need um a compact for most of most steps of my makeup regimen. But if you're not, then you're well aware. But here we go. Fenty Beauty by Rihanna time. Ooh, look up close, too. I'm not even wearing foundation and, and concealer. Ooh, that bronze. I swear it, like, chisels your jaw. Oh, my God, yeah. It, like, gives my forehead so much definition. I don't look like nearly as basic of a bitch, and it's like I'm almost wearing concealer and foundation. I love it. You're like, yeah, do I have dark circ eye under eye bags? Absolutely, but the blue and the purple and um, those colors and stuff, and it, it just all distracts you from the bags, so I'm here for it. <laughs> okay. Cupid's bow action time. Beautiful. I like when it does that W shape into your lip product. Mm. God, I wish I'm. One day I'm going to do a full face of highlighter. Actually, like one of my next videos, like comment down below and let me know if you'd be interested in seeing this. Um, I want to do because I have like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. I have 19 different lipsticks that are um, new. So um, I want to do like, um, I want to just do a layer of each lipstick and just see what the color is. You know what I mean? It's probably going to just turn like, it's probably just going to turn like brown or black, but I'm really curious to see what happens. Okay, this is the second to last step in my um, get ready with me process slash um, achieving a full face of blue and pink. And I really don't think that um, contour and um, bronzing uh, and foundation and concealer like um, necessarily and this um, necessarily like uh, are against the rules of this challenge or something like that you couldn't do because that's not the case. Um, it's just for fun. If you guys want to try it, you can. I'd be really really flattered. Like, please like get um, let all information about any um, challenges that you guys um, decide to do based off my channel, uh, please let me know in the comments down below. Um, I'd really appreciate it because that would be the most cathartic and humbling and amazing thing to see because I love seeing. Um, I, I obviously, like it, um, if you guys are, aren't, 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 aren't new to my channel, and even if you are, I'll let you guys know. If you subscribe to my channel, I always subscribe back. It doesn't matter if you even make videos. It's just kind of like um, a pay it forward kind of thing because I, I just appreciate it so much. Okay, and since this is a freestyle highlighter, and you guys know I'm not a little bit, I'm a little bit crazy, and I love, I love to do that C-shape around my eyebrows, like similar to like how you do, your, in the, similar to the um, fashion that you apply your blush, or how most people apply their blush, as far as I'm concerned, um, but I just love that look, and it's like, do I look sweaty from certain angles, but like, she's still holding it together? Absolutely, and that's my goal, girls and boys. <clears throat> Excuse me. I left my beverage in the other room, and I'm not doing another jump cut because I ain't got to. I ain't got. I don't have to. I, I don't talk that way unless I'm doing um unless I'm on camera. Oh my god. Okay. Twirly, twirly, twirly on the tip of that nose. So f from everywhere I go, you're gonna see it glow. That's a little rap I came up came up with in yesterday's video. Comment down below if you remember. And that 
it was the second to last step in my get ready with me process and full face of pink and blue makeup challenge. But um, thank you guys so much for watching, and until next time. Oh my god, that stuff is so good. Okay. Alright. Until next time, you guys. Thank you so much for giving my little side girl to Pinka Channel a chance. And I actually got it right that time. I didn't stutter. Good for me. Good for you, girl. But, um, thank you guys so much for watching. I love how my, um, fan matches my eyes to a T. And yes, I actually did pretty good on the whole, like, sisters not twins thing today. But if you squint hard enough, they might just be twins. And I was going to do falsies, but I was like, you know what? I have long, beautiful, natural lashes, so I might as well just enhance this with mascara. Oh, I forgot to mention, I use um, Clinique High Impact Mascara um, 01 Black. It's fantastic. I've had it for like a year and a half. It's probably expired, but I don't care um, because this is the year of authenticity. And if I cared, I would have gotten a new one by now. But um, I really like this look. Um, it really didn't take me that long. I didn't even use foundation and concealer. But I use bronzer and contour, which... Um, is isn't necessarily a first for my channel, but it's definitely one, um, a, a first of me, like, bringing it up and being like, this is where I did it, you know what I mean? Like, I normally just kind of do it and, and like, let the, um, the, the, the people that comment and stuff, like, decide for themselves. But thank you so much for being here. Um, you guys are the reason that I wake up in the morning. Uh, Mom, Dad, Joey, um, Madison, my sister, anybody, if you guys see this, I love you so much. And, um, thank you guys for coming with me along this wacky, wacky journey that is YouTube. I love you.